I will explain the new features which we implemented recently as part of algo trading. Once the explanation is over on these new features, I got several questions through WhatsApp and through mail on this algo trading. So I will address those questions. Let's get started without any further delay. The new features are earlier the order quantity was fixed. Now we can customize based on the day. Suppose today is 5th of September. You want to trade 150 quantities, you can keep. But tomorrow you want to trade 175, you can press according date. Wednesday, the margin will be very less to trade triangle or straddle. So most of the people will try to increase their quantity. So in that case, you can keep 200. On expiry day, the margin is very less compared to remaining all the days. So you can keep the quantity as per your wish. The thing is, you can customize your order quantity based on that day. And next one is stop loss. The customer stop loss also based on the day. What it means is, suppose you want to keep Mondays and Tuesdays 30% stop loss. You want to keep Wednesdays as 50% stop loss and Thursdays 100% stop loss. You can say in one shot or else if you want to keep a fixed stop loss, you can also do that. What you have to do is you can keep everywhere fixed thing fixed value which means if you want to keep 30 percentage as stop loss for all the days you can keep 30 everywhere as simple as that so this is the new feature and uh, before going to uh, frequently asked questions i will try to explain the con job how to schedule so, so it will give better idea this is how the con job look like remove this entire part from your mind because this is a constant value you will not change this value in future so this is constant value so there is no confusion in that so you can remove that value from your mind just for now and we will focus on this part first of all i will explain what is this the first value will represent minutes second value will represent hour the third value third value will represent date date in the sense today is fifth this value may be 1 to 30 or 31. This value will represent month. This final last value will represent day of the week. Suppose Monday or Tuesday, Wednesday, something like that. Star means all. Suppose if I keep star in date place, it will execute in all the days. Means 1 to 31. So we will have 1 to 31 dates in a month. So if we keep star here, it will execute for all the months from January to December. If we keep star in last place, which means it will execute all the days, means Monday to Sunday. These three are not that much important. So we will focus on this hour and minutes. So suppose you want to place order set 930 every day. You can keep here 9 in the place of hour. You can keep 30 in the place of minutes which means 930 algo will run at 930 suppose you want to trade this straddle on monday tuesday wednesday at 930 and you want to trade this straddle on expiry days at 12 o'clock so you can simply change the dates so instead of star we can keep monday is 5 6 is tuesday and 7 is wednesday that's all. So it will execute on these days. On expiry day, you want to trade at 12 o'clock. For that, what we have to do is you have to keep 12 o'clock here, 12 at house place, 08 minutes place, and Thursday's date is 8. As simple as that. So the algo will start running at 12 o'clock on expiry day, which is on September 8th. Let's move to new features of closest premium strategy before moving to FAQ. So this is the configuration file of closest premium strategy. You can customize by your own the order quantity as well as stop loss based on that day. Also, you can customize the closest premium. Suppose on Fridays you want to trade close to 200, you can put date and premium. On Mondays you want to trade close to 150, you can keep. On expiry days you want to trade close to 20 or 30 rupees premium, you can put accordingly. Now let's move to FAQs. So I have listed out all the questions here. 
whatever I got the questions through call or through WhatsApp. I will answer one by one. The first one is, do I need to generate request token every day and pass to all go? The answer is no. You no need to create manually and pass. It will automatically create and it will take care of everything. Now, second one is, is TOTP login is automated for Zerodha? Yes, it is fully automated. You no need to do anything manually. Do I need to take off any paid tools to use this algo? No. The answer is no. You no need to take any paid subscription of any tool. Next one is, can I trade more than freeze limit? Yes, you can trade more than freeze limit also. You can trade 4000 also. You can trade 5000 also as per your capital. Can I set different stop loss percentage for different days? Yes, you can set. Next one is, how secure is my algo? Your algo is 100% secure. No one can hack or no one can change the program logic because it is in AWS. And next one is, how secure is my strategy? I got this question from one guy. He asked this question through phone call. Suppose I will give a sell percentage and timing of my strategy, which is going to reveal to you. So I have concern on this issue. So then what I told is we will not ask your strategy or your SL percentage or your execution time. We will explain everything to you. You can set up by your one without anyone's help. So in this way, your strategy is completely secure, which is not going to reveal to anyone. And next one is, can anyone access my algo in the world? The answer is, Literally, no one can access your algo unless you share AWS username and password. And next one is, do you ask my broker's username and password to set up algo? No, we will not ask your username and password. Next one is, how long will you support for queries and doubts? Generally, to understand this algo, it will take one day. But we want to take responsibility for 30 days to clarify your doubts or query through zoom call post that also you can contact us for your queries and questions through whatsapp support and next one is how can I trust you and can i edit my python script see friends to cheat the people in trading there are several ways we can conduct webinars by showing fake profit and loss statements by preparing some junk strategies using some two or three indicators like RSI and moving averages. But we did not choose that path because I am 0% believer of a trainer can make another person as a successful trader. If that works out by this time, everyone in the world should be a trader. We developed a genuine product by taking all necessary precautions that user should not have a fear on their username and password or strategy is going to someone. There is no scope for such things in this algo. The idea is algo should be in your hands that algo should not be controlled by anyone. You can set up your own strategy by your own. That's the main idea of this algo. And finally, we are not here to cheat anyone. We just want to sell our genuine product with minimal cost. And next one is, can I trade my straddle with next week options if I need? Yes, you can trade with next week options as well. And next one is very, very important thing. What is SEBI circular on algo trading? Recently, SEBI given a circular on algo trading. The conclusion of that circular is, if there is any unauthorized public platform, showing past es profit and providing algo platform and providing algo platform for public which is illegal if you have your own strategy if you want to automate it which is completely allowed there is no restriction on that and next one is can i set different quantity for different days yes you can set different quantity for different days from friday to thursday and next one is 
can I train both strangle and straddle with same algo by my own? Yes, you can absolutely trade both strangle and straddle with the same script by your own without anyone's help. And final one is any plans to implement auto square of future. To develop this future, it will take hardly three to four days, max to max one week, including testing and everything. But the reason we don't want to implement this future is since trading is a business, if we don't have five minutes to put on it on a single day basis, which is very serious thing that everyone, including me, have to look into it. If we keep auto square of future, you will completely rely on it. If there is any problem from broker side or exchange side or algo side, you will not able to notice. And one more thing is, since you are completely rely on auto square of future, you will not track your strategy performance which is profit and losses suppose if you forgot to close your open position for that one particular day you will not affect much because since we are executing mis orders the open positions will be closed by broker by end of the day only thing you will lose is auto square of charges after thinking all the scenarios we came to conclusion that we have more advantages then disadvantages to not implement this future. If we develop this future in upcoming days, which will be completely free for existing users. If you are really interested on this algo, you can reach out through WhatsApp or email. Details will be given in this video description along with the first video of algo trading. Thank you for watching.